And so we are counting with Venn diagrams, and here we are, we're going to camp again, and there are all these fantastic activities that we can do. We want to know uh, about uh, what racket sports are available and uh, what ball sports are available. So what, uh, what sports involve rackets and what sports involve balls? Well, when I look here, I think, well, basketball, this is obviously goes into the ball sports. Soccer, for sure. Volleyball, yes, ball sport. Football, no, that's a ball sport. Uh, baseball, definitely ball sport. Cricket, of course, that's from England. Uh, I think there's a ball involved with that. And let's see, in a racket sport, badminton and tennis, yes, racket sport as well. Now, notice this. We have a kind of a problem here in that tennis involves both a racket and a ball. And so we're going to introduce this idea of the intersection of two sets now. And so to adequately represent this, what happens is we overlap the two sets with our Venn diagram, and we put things that have characteristics of both into this little part where they overlap. Now this is known as the intersection of two sets and uh, we sometimes symbolize it with this sort of an upside down horseshoe. So and so when I look at this R upside down horseshoe B this means the intersection set of R and B and it means elements that belong to both sets. You'll notice poor old flying a kite still sits out here in the universe of things that I can do but it doesn't fall into either of these two sets.